hello friends welcome back to automation testing .com. so in the last video we talked about uh, how to handle drag and drop using selenium web driver and in this video i'll show you how to handle tooltip so first of all we need to understand like what is tooltip and then we'll uh, automate it okay we'll uh, i'll show you a demo how to work with tooltip okay so tooltip basically a message which appears when a cursor is positioned over an image or an icon or any other web element like uh, uh, hyperlinks okay so that is uh, tooltip i'll show you uh, how it looks and uh, what uh, tooltip is basically so let me just go over my blog so here we have search box right search this blog so if you mouse over here you will see search this message appears okay so this is tooltip message another example if you go to google page so this when you mouse over here on google search screen search box okay you will see search this message and uh, one more link i have here from demoqa.com okay so if you go to if you navigate to that and here we have a best example of mouse over 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 me to see tooltip okay so here this message appears okay so this is tooltip message so these are the different tooltip messages okay and we need to understand like we need to look into it uh, how to handle this using selenium web driver okay so let's first automate this one okay let's capture the message this message and then we'll see uh, this one later on So my Eclipse is already open. So here I'll create new class. I'll give tool tip demo public static void main, and uh, I'll copy the few lines of code as we normally does, right, from the previous class. to launch the browser and uh, <coughs> I'm sorry so I need to change the URL so, this is the URL of my blog so simply copy paste here and what is the next step we have to inspect this search box so right click and inspect So here we have this class. Okay, so let's uh, write an XPath for this input at the rate class that is an attribute and paste this. This is the class name, right? From here we have copied. So this an XPath we found one of one element okay so it is highlighting that particular element right you can see so we can use this xpath driver dot find element by dot xpath and simply will copy paste inside double quotes and let's store this in a web element and I'll give name search box. And we have to import web element from org.openq.selenium. Okay, this is done. And uh, what is next? So if you can see here we have an attribute called title. Okay. So whenever uh, we have this title so for tooltip when we have this title attribute then we can directly we can capture this uh, value okay from this attribute so that is uh, the tooltip message okay so how to capture this message so we have a method called get attribute okay so what is the attribute we want title and uh, 
we can store the value in a string we have to store the value in a string variable okay because this will return a string and I'll give a tool message okay or tool tip text let's say text okay and simply you can print this tool tip text is and we have to concatenate this one and simply let's close the browser so everything is ready so what we have done uh, we have launched the browser and using this navigated to this URL automation testing center.com and uh, this is the X path we have found we have inspected the element and store in a web element search box okay and uh, using get attribute method we are uh, uh, we get uh, we'll try to get the uh, an attribute that that is title so that will this get attribute will returns uh, a string value so we'll store in this tooltip text variable okay and later on we are going to print this using system dot 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 print in okay and at last we are closing the browser so let's run this program <coughs> I'm sorry launching the browser navigated to my blog and it will close once it is fully loaded and then it will close at the end so you can see the tooltip text is search you can verify this using a if and else condition as well but this is what we are we wanted to you know test right the search it should extract the search message text okay now let's uh, uh, look for another demo from this website demoqa.com so if you mouse over here we'll okay we have this message this is tooltip message so let's automate this one so what we'll do simply I'll copy this class and paste it over here I'll change the name to tooltip demo 1 so I'll change the URL and uh, instead of search box so let's inspect this one this element first okay this element so what do we have ID tooltip demo so let's use this one only uh, I'm not uh, let's once again simply I have to change this to ID and instead of this X path we have to put ID okay we are inspecting this element right and what is this let's say mouse over mouse over okay now here we do not have any attribute if you can see we do not have any attributes uh, which uh, equal to title right we do not have title attribute here so if you mouse over here we'll get this message okay so in the last video we have seen one method that is uh, move to element okay so we'll use this one but before that let's create the object of actions class actions and 
here action class actions class will come into picture we have to import these actions from org.openk.selenium.interactions okay and using let's uh, comment this line okay now using that object we have moved to element right and we'll use this mouse over element and dot perform okay so what is the first task we we'll simply will mouse over here okay later on we'll extract the text from this the element which appears now the message so we have to how to inspect this One second. Span and we have class attribute. This is the X path. Okay. So you can see for that message, this is the X path. You can see one of one. Okay, we can copy this. Okay, so this is action will perform mouse over here okay and later on we have to capture this text so how to capture driver dot find element by dot x path will give the x path and let's store in web element let's say tool tip message okay and simply dot get text here I'll write message let's remove this one no use of this okay so it's very simple first of all we are launching the this URL and uh, we have created the object of actions class and later on we have inspected this field okay when you mouse over here th this message will appear so first of all we have to move to this element right so we have inspected that element so this is that element and later on using move to element we move to this mouse over here okay and perform this action and later on after performing after going to this we we need to get we need to extract this message okay so this an x path for that one that uh, message and later on simply we are extracting the text using get text method so let me just run it so the output should be this message which appears here we ask for your age only for this message okay so let me run this browser is launched it will navigate to demoqa.com and then it will mouse over you can see and then so here you can see the message is we ask for your age only for statistical purposes okay so here we got the message so this is how you can handle tooltip so i have explained in two ways okay so in the next video probably we'll see multi select actions and mouse over there is auto suggestion as well mouse over i'll uh, explain in a separate video okay so thank you guys for watching have a nice day bye bye please subscribe my channel thank you